Testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing. Hopefully I'm recording this time. I filmed the entire video and just realized that the mic was not connected to the camera. So this is gonna be take two. Hopefully we get this thing popping. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Mao. Today we're gonna to be talking about a special shoe that got restocked recently. We were able to pick up a pair. So shout out to Better Generation for having a quick and easy restock process and letting me cop for retail. Not going for much anymore, but today we're talking about the 2021 original release of the Dusty Olives. So they're bringing all those back. They're bringing back the Dusty Olives. Uh, medium curries and then later this month or not February but later in March they're gonna be bringing back the ugly duckling so I'm gonna go ahead and pick those up I know I said I was done doing general releases but that's what th those are some of the pairs that I wanted for a long time so we're just gonna go ahead and, and buy those and we're gonna we're just gonna keep on trucking Nike just been releasing banger after banger. Um, I really appreciate them bringing back some of these shoes from the COVID area, COVID era. Since there were, I wasn't gonna pay 400 bucks for some dunks at that time. Like that was ridiculous. But getting back to the shoe, before I go on off on the tangent, I got them right here. We're just gonna put them off to the side. We're gonna take a look at them reason why I really like these shoes is the fact that it's a staple at least in my wardrobe currently like I wear lots of browns lots of like nude colors or not nude more like neutral like neutral colors the reason I believe that this is a staple in any wardrobe and not just mine is the fact that it has such a good blend of colors you got your brown, pro gold, and what's the other one? Dusty olive. Anyways, it's a good blend of three colors. Goes with any outfit. Easy to wear and just looks good on feet. Like there's so simple, but yet so effective when it comes to putting an outfit together. So just stick around for the rest of the video. We're gonna take a look at the shoe. Towards the end of the video, we're gonna put down th three, four, maybe five outfits. I have no idea at this point. We're gonna put together some outfits, do a little fit check. So make sure to stick around, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'm gonna just kind of be making these videos try weekly. We'll, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. But anyways, let's just get into the shoe real quick. To show off the shoe a little bit, we can begin talking about what makes this shoe one of my favorites. And that the most notable part is obviously gonna be all the suede upper, or the, the whole suede upper, I guess you could say. You got your brown, dusty olive, green, and then your pro gold, and the swoosh, outsole, and laces. And this kind of makes it pop. I, for one, am a big fan of how the suede breaks in and the feel of the shoe after a few wears. I have another pair of all suede dunks and even though they, they look cooked, they're just so comfortable to wear and they, in my eyes, I think they still look pretty good, especially if you're wearing like an all vintage fit. So yellow is not like one of my favorite colors, but this pro gold version of it just kind of works with this shoe, right? The brown and yellow go really well with each other. Just kind of like the, I think there were the Jordan 1 Palominos where they have that gold um, Nike swoosh on it, yet it's a brown and black shoe, I think. Yeah. Um, but the yellow, the yellow or pro gold goes really well with this shoe, makes it pop. And then the rest of the shoe, like the brown and the sage kind of tones it down and makes it more neutral and easily wearable. I'll be wearing this shoe probably like a couple days a week, definitely on the weekends. I'll be, this is kind of what I've been looking for as far as a daily driver in a shoe is something easy to wear. I can wear multiple, multiple items, multiple like spring colors, summer, since we're kind of headed towards that way. 
This is gonna be a this is gonna be a great fall shoe, especially with the brown. This is gonna be on par with my Jordan One Mochas, probably for most wearable during that October pumpkin spice season. So, and then just for like a little sneak peek for the next video, we're gonna be making a video on these real quick. I don't know if you guys can see that, but pick these up for a steal. So. I had to another GR, but I mean, this is just a really good looking shoe. Gives me a poor man Ama Manier vibes. So we're gonna be reviewing that this coming week. I'm gonna try to grind out the video a lot faster, but like I said, like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna try to keep these videos short and sweet. Um, I'll see you guys on the next one.